What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is me, Halo Fan One Two Three here, and yes, um, if you guys go to my channel, I have two channels: Nick Nicholas Sanchez, and then or Nick Sanchez, and then Halo Fan One Two Three Halo. I know I said Halo Fan One Two Three Halo. I'm just gonna say Halo One Two Three because there is a Halo at the end. I just don't know how to get it off. Um. Yeah, but before I even get anywhere next to this video, please give this video a thumbs up down below. And, um, <laughs> uh, did you guys just see what I did there? I just said you guys could give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down. It's up to you guys. And please subscribe to my channel. And today I'm going to be, um, talking about my top five favorite Star Wars figures and Halo Megablox figures. So, yeah. Or at least that I have. So, yeah. So let's just get on with the Star Wars ones first. So over here, these are all my Star Wars guys so far. Because <laughs> I, like, just got into it. Um, here's all these little guys that I built not too long ago. If you guys don't know, that's an X-Wing. That's a Millenni Millennium Falcon. Um, Imperial Shuttle. A little Starfighter. Uh, separatist spider droid mini version. Forgot. Um, I'm guessing that's the Republican forget. And I have no idea what this is right here. That's a mouse robot type thing. Forgot the name of that one. Snow speeder and something else right there. So I can name almost all these. So yeah. And I have the Star Wars book here that I like to look at sometimes. Um, so yeah, General Grievous is one of my favorite figures, but I'm not going to say he's one of my top five because he is not here with me right now. So let's just get on with this. So number one, we shall get on with him. Number one, I would say, is the guard, or the red guard. Because, let's just see if I can find his proper name real fast. Sorry guys, I am just like forgot his name. Um, I think it's the Red Honor Guard. I'm not too sure. Um, so yeah. Sorry guys, I'm just looking through my book here. But yeah. He, oh yeah. Okay. So, I'd say he's pretty cool. I have the name of him right here. Under here. Um, right here. So it turns out. He is, it doesn't show his name anywhere in here, I don't think. Oh, yep, he is the, s dang it, I have no idea what his name is actually. So, <clears throat> sorry guys, please give this video a thumbs down if you guys want to, because this is actually really boring. I know. Yeah, it doesn't name him in here. Anyways, yeah, so there's that. Yeah, I would say he's one of my top five. He's not the best one. The number one is the best one. So, I'd say he's on my top five. And, yep, of course he has the black helmet. I mean, black head. These guys don't even need a face, to be honest. Their face is right there. Right through there. And, yeah, he's just a super cool figure. And he comes with that cape and stuff. That nice red. He's like all red. And he comes with, um, I have two of these guys. And he comes with these little savers right here. That don't even look like light savers. And yeah. So, oops, this helmet just came off. Hold on a sec, guys. Let me put his helmet back on here. Didn't put that on. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, guys. And please go check out my real ghost pepper challenge. Um, yeah, I just ate it at school today, so yeah. And then, my second one would probably be the blue jetpack guy. Um, stormtrooper type guy. He is super, he's pretty cool. He's my number top four. Um, he's got that nice blue helmet. Uh, I have this one Star Wars game, or at least I had it. I'm pretty sure I still have it. But, he is in there. And yeah, and he comes with that face he doesn't have a double face um and yeah he all these guys right here these three guys uh they all come in the same face 
which is I think is pretty dang cool. So, see if I get a better look at that face for you guys. There you go. So yep, he looks kind of mad too. And then his helmet has a pretty good design, a storm trooper helmet type guy. So yep, and he and all three of them do come with the jetpack. I think there's about four, but I'm not too sure. Next would probably be these guys. They're exactly the same, but uh, except <laughs> different colors. This is one of my top third favorite guys. He is pretty cool. Sorry, guys. He's pretty cool, you know. He's got that nice, weird face. These wings right here, or wings, are plastic, and they were pretty tough to put on, but not really. His head is all one color, except for his eyes. Now, his eyes are pretty cool. Let's see if I get a better look at his eyes for you. There you go. There you go. And they've all, and both of them have the same exact design, just different colors. And there's a little bit of printing, printing on the back. Next, I would say for my top second, would be one of my funniest, one of the funniest guys in Star Wars, Jar Jar Binks. Now he is pretty cool. Um, I have this other version of Jar Jar Binks, but I wouldn't really say he's Jar Jar Binks. I'd say he's a version of Jar Jar Binks. He's pretty cool. He's got those cool looking eyes that just pop up. His voice is really funny. And he's just got a nice orange color to him. He's got those long ears, I think. And he's got printing there. And back printing, I believe. Yeah, a little bit of back printing on the belt. Next, I would say for my top first favorite figure would be drumroll, please. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Chewbacca. Now, I will be getting more better figures, so Chewbacca won't always be my first favorite guy, but yeah, so far he is my favorite. It comes to that crossbow right there. But so far, he is my favorite because he's just a super cool little figure. And there are, this is the older version of Jar, uh, Chewbacca. And his head is actually pretty cool. You take off his head. If I can do it, it's pretty tough. Um, it's all one big piece. So, so that piece right there. And it's just all brown. He's got some silver belting crossbow ammo. So, yeah. He is one of my, he is my top first favorite figure. Now it's my Halo guys. Whoa. Okay, so starting at number five. My top number five favorite figure would be, huh, Noble Six. Um, the reason why I pick Noble 6 is because he is pretty cool and he's from the Noble team on Halo Reach if you guys have ever played Halo Reach. He's in that nice dark gray, he comes with a black assault rifle and he has a nice gold visor. Next up, I would say my top 4th favorite figure. Hold on. My fourth favorite figure would be the Arbiter from Halo 5. And I know he is from Halo 5 because I've played Halo 5 before, and he works on the good people side. His helmet, he's all one gold color. He's got that nice spiky feet. He's got that nice old mask with that nice spiky in the back. Peg hold right there. One armor on one arm and one non-painted armor. Now he is super cool and he is super awesome. Starting at number four on the list. Now my top favorite third guy would be Fred from Blue Team from Halo 5. Now Fred... Um, he's pretty cool. He's from Blue Team on Halo 5. I had no idea he was, and I'm glad I have him now, and yeah. 
And my top favorite, second favorite figure of all times is Master Chief from also Halo 5. He is super cool. He's got that nice cracked visor from when Locke and him fight. If you guys don't know who Locke is, why don't you guys just go check out, search up Halo 5 on YouTube, he'll definitely pop up. He's got that nice deep voice, but Master Chief and Locke get into a fight and he gets his visor cracked, cracked, but he does get a new one near the end of the mission. So he's super cool and he comes with a black assault rifle. Now my top first favorite figure so far that I have is the Arbiter from the Phantom. The reason why I put him up here separate is because he's one of my favorite figures. Um, <clears throat> he's my top first favorite figure. Now he's got that beautiful, beautiful gold, silver. His I ordered him online with uh, the white pilot right there. And his legs came really loose so I just keep him on this... Um, platform right here but that's okay i'm thinking about army building these arbiters i don't care because they might get rare later on in the days especially the pax hog the ce warthog not gold arbiter my mom actually will not get me that because it's a collectible and my mom doesn't like me getting collectibles for some reason but like um yeah i might start army building these guys and actually start army i'm and yeah so and on the star wars i might start um army building the or the um general grievous guy of all three versions he's got the general grievous starfighter the original one uh where he's just all white and the other general grievous starfighter where he's got that nice gold kind of tan color and then the general grievous wheel bike pretty cool right something about getting all three versions of general groups so yeah and then join me guys on my ghost pepper challenge video <laughs> and it's pretty funny please give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down please comment down below if you guys think this video should have done a little bit better and please comment down below which guys do you like better please name who you like better on the star wars side and please comment who you like better on the halo side and this is halo one two, halo fan one two three here signing off